again, everyone. It's Matt. And Chels. And today, we are here to check out the Batman trailer. I like Batman. I like Batman, too. I'll be real with you guys. Be real. I'm a little pessimistic about Robert Pattinson playing mm, Batman. I forgot that that... I haven't been this pessimistic about someone playing Batman since George Clooney did in Batman and Robin. And how did he do? Oh, God. Oh, oops. That's a, that is, okay, it is not a good movie. It is not a good movie, but it is a fun movie. I still go back and watch that movie at least once every, you know, five or six years. Because it's, I mean, fucking nipples on the bat suit. There were nipples on the bat suit? Well, I'm going to say this one probably didn't go that way. And that's where I'm going to say next. DC... Those movies are really miss for me, except for movies with Batman. Love the Batman movies. The link to this trailer is down below. Our links are down there as well. And please don't forget to... Like and subscribe. And hit the notification button. There you go. There you go. Here we go. And I'll tell you my favorite Batman. I feel like I've said that before. It is what it is. Will you use Batman voice? <laughs> no. no, I'll use Bane boys. No. Police! Hands up! Stay still! Get out of here! Just gonna work as the Riddler. Fear is a tool. But when that light hits the sky, it's not just a call. It's a warning. So, I'm not sold. I'll be real. I'm not sold. It does look like a dark Batman movie. A uh, little fact, I, didn't, I don't know if you knew this or not, but the guy that was screaming, yes, I got you, that was actually Colin Farrell. He's got a prosthetic on and everything. I had no idea he that was He plays the him. Penguin. So mm -hmm. we've got him as the Penguin, Paul Dano, I think that's his name, as the Riddler, uh, I, for the life of me, just forgot the, the girl's name that's playing, uh, Catwoman. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I'm not, 
It looks action packed. It looks like the violent Batman. But I'm not 100% sold on it. I've got to be real. That was a lot of action that they showed us and not a whole lot of substance in a in a different way. Exactly kind of my point. And that is something I feel DC does a lot of is they they throw the action your direction but the substance isn't really there. Yeah. In every DC film. Then again, that was just a trailer. Perhaps they didn't show substance part. Yeah, that's that's true. I'm um, also, I mean, check it out. oh, I will, we will, and see. Here's the thing: is we weren't the first couple of trailers we saw of Joker with Joaquin Phoenix. We were just like, I'm not, I'm not sold on this. And then we movie. watched it, and it's one of the best DC movies that's it's been made, in my opinion. This could be up there. It could be just like that. I'm still bummed that we don't get, you know, more of. Uh, Ben Affleck as Batman because I thought we were going a good positive direction with that guy. He's got the voice. Like Robert here didn't have the voice, but I think this is supposed to be a younger Batman mm. before he sounded like he smoked a carton a day. And, Where is he? Yeah, you know. Yeah. Thank you so much for watching. We hope you enjoyed this reaction, and we'll see you next time. Bye. Goodbye. <laughs>